6, a bill proposed by an East Texas lawmaker would lower some of the requirements for working in the beauty industry. State Senator Bob Hill's Senate Bill 101 would allow workers to blow dry style without a license. KLTV 7's Michael Richardson spoke with Hall and a hairstylist who thinks this bill would be detrimental to her industry. Senate Bill 101, sponsored by State Senator Bob Hall, would remove the requirement for a license to do blow-dry styling. We're not, not intending to impact anything except for hair drying. Hall says a main reason for the law is to reduce regulations. This falls into the category of one of those regulations that's, that's out there that just causes someone to spend a lot of money and a lot of time getting training. I think that it's detrimental to our industry. Erica Bobo, who has worked in the beauty industry for 20 years, is against lowering the license requirement. These services are going to be performed by people who don't have the proper training and the proper background. I feel like people who do have licenses and have trained and have experience um, will kind of be uh, edged out in a way because uh, people that are coming in, they took the shortcut. Hall feels blow dry styling is not dangerous. There is nothing dangerous to the to the person involved in the process. It's simply washing the hair and blow drying it. It's not the first time a law has been proposed lowering requirements in the industry. A bill put forth during the 85th legislative session would have reduced the amount of hours needed to obtain a cosmetology license from 1,500 to 1,000. Michael Richardson, KLTV 7 News. Now, the average cost to go through a cosmetology program here in the state of Texas is roughly $14,000, according to the website Cosmetology License.